that's Katie Art. At least that's what I think I'm gonna call my channel. I know it might change. But, um, this is my very first video. Um, I'm recording this on my iPad using the Apple pen Pencil. I don't know which one it is or nothing about it. But I'm kind of new to digital art. Um, I like drawing on paper because, you know, it's definitely cool having like layers and um like layers and like so many little like tricks and stuff on digital but i like having like a physical connection with my drawings and stuff and it's also easier you can literally just carry it everywhere without having to worry about like wires or and stuff like that but this drawing is not, it's not really in specific but I drew her in like, oh, what's it called? An overall dress? Jean dress? I don't know. But, um, because I, I like them. I've always wanted one, so I just drew it. And this character, it does kind of look on, like, like me. Kind of like, you know, I, eyebrows are on flame. But. Yeah, and I like her hairstyle. I don't really have, like, an afro like that. I have more, like, a curly, mixed type person hair. But, yeah, I did the hands. The hands don't really look that good. I definitely need more practice. But I kind of didn't want to put so much to it. Maybe I have to do a video of me practicing how to put hands on the That would be fun. But, um, I'm the legs. We're doing the legs now. I tried to get them, like, really perfectly straight. But I wasn't really doing a good job. And now I'm doing the shoes. I like drawing shoes, but it can be kind of difficult because, like, I know nothing about shoes and I don't really know how to draw feet. So if I knew how to draw feet, it would probably help me draw shoes better. But I like drawing the laces on shoes and stuff. I definitely enjoy that. I don't know why. I think you just like it's so tidy and like. Oh, sorry. And like everything is like different. I like people. Yeah, that looks, I like that shoelace. It looks really cool. Um, yeah, but for the overall dress, I like the colors, which you'll see later on, but yeah. And then this part's funny. Okay. So I was, I, the girls has like her foot bent, but I didn't know what to draw. So it just made it look like maybe like she was like on a stool or something. Maybe she's like cleaning the kitchen, helping her mom, and her mom's short, and so she got a stool for her mom, and she's showing it off to her mom or something, I don't know. Everything, every drawing has a story. And then this part, as you can see, I kind of forgot to record, like, me coloring the skin or whatever, but I, like, just kind of scribble it, and then I erase it, because, like, I don't really, I'm not very patient, and I don't want to, like, really try coloring the lines or whatever. And it's one of the benefits of digital art. It's not like you have to worry about like smudges or like leaving things behind. Like remnants from the previous color that was on the paper or whatever. So you're gonna have to hear my voice. It's very late at night, I'm kinda tired. My voice for like 11 minutes, I think, yeah. This part, I remember, was very, very difficult. Oh, I just remembered I forgot to color in the belt, I think. When I was doing the drawing. Oh, well, it's okay. Um, I really hope that you guys can actually hear my voice, though. Because I have no idea what I'm doing. I was watching videos the other day on, like, YouTube, like, creating a YouTube channel. And, like, expect their first three, like, videos to be trash. So I don't really expect this to be good or whatever, but, um, yeah. But I like, I do like this drawing. I don't really know, how, right now I'm shading the face, but I don't really know how to shade faces or, like, anything about them. Well, I can draw a really good face, but, like, digitally, like, I have no idea. Like, it's easier when you can, like, use your fingers and, like, smear it and whatever, or, like, use a blending stump in real life. But it's, like, so different in, like, digital because, like, you don't know, like, how like your pencil's turning or like the sensitivity of like 
pencil so I feel like they're actually pushing on the paper. Definitely different experience and it's a lot smoother. It's kind of, it's really different. But, you know, we gotta learn. It looks really weird right now. So. Oh, sorry. Oh, green text messages. Um, well, yeah. Sorry, I got it all off track. Yeah, I don't really know anything about faces, but I changed the lip color. Um, I know it kind of looks like she's an old person because I put like wrinkles like near her nose or whatever, like maybe it went to the smile or something. So it kind of looks like an old person, but I don't know. And then this part I ended up erasing because like it was just way too much. Anyway, this weekend, um, it's November, and Frozen 2 came out. It was really good. It was it was really nice to go see it, because, you know, like, Frozen was, like, a big char part of my childhood growing up and stuff. Because it came out when I was a kid. Like, maybe, like, I think I was eight when it came out. But, um, yeah, it was really neat going to see that with my friends and stuff. It's so cool, like, Disney has, like, grown so much. I mean, they've, like, probably since then, they've gotten, I don't know if they own Nickelodeon. They, I don't think they do. No, but they own Marvel, they own St um, Star Wars, they own so much stuff now, and they got, like, uh, Disney Plus and everything. It's crazy how much money they're probably making. I really hope that one day it can work for them. Oh yeah, now I'm coloring the dress. I really like this blue. It's like it's a navy blue. And for a while, navy blue was actually my favorite color. But it's not really mine anymore. But I like the other blue. Yeah, I tried shading um, on the jean dress. I don't know how, like, shading on, like, jean dresses and stuff work. But, um, I just did what, like, I would normally do, like, on regular pencil and paper. And then, yeah, this is the blue that I really liked and whatever. I was trying to draw sunflower on the dress because I know I really like sunflowers, but I have no idea how to draw sunflowers on a computer. I can paint them, like in real life, but not on a computer. And I just did the hair. I, I did it on a different layer because I like to. But that's, this part looks really weird. But I didn't know how to do braids and I didn't really feel like adding little details.
what am I doing now? I'm stopping. Oh yeah, I added like a uh, texture to the hair to make it look like um like an afro. I need to get to bed soon. Like I have to wake up early for church. But I can't stop now. Um, coloring the shoes. I don't know. I just did red because you know red's a good color. But um. I was trying to draw like a logo, like, I don't know, but it didn't really work out. But I realized I had like a scribble left behind.